Legend of Total War here with a new campaign series. This time we're coming back to Medieval 2 Total War and we're going with the mod Stainless Steel 6.4. Now if you've uh, gone on my Facebook page you already know what campaign I'm doing. We're playing the uh, late campaign as the Quaresmian Empire on very high difficulty and I also have the Advanced Supply Script 4 enabled, Longer Assimilations and uh, Disable Real Recruitment. So basically the point of this campaign is to survive to survive and destroy the Mongol invasion, which is supposed to be really fucking hard with this faction because basically the Mongols have an almost unlimited supply of, of soldiers. Anyway, let's get started. So the major things I'm going to come into problems with is that obviously I can't stop the Mongols at first. All I could do is probably delay them. I need to seriously fix up my income because the advanced supply script basically makes you poor. And I need to expand as far west as possible because I'm going to need to basically unite all of uh, the Islamic world in order to do this. Which isn't going to be easy. What the fuck is all this shit? Alright, so they're fucking giving me all this crap. Don't know why it does that. Okay. First thing I need to do is get the Shah fucking out of here. What is the Sultan's will? Okay, so we'll leave just one unit of the them behind. Because I want to keep this army. Even though I would save a lot of money by disbanding them or even losing the army. I want to use these guys. I mean, these they're not bad troops. And I can use them to expand maybe on the Turks. Now, it's going to be hard getting away from here, but I've got to get away from like that. Also, since I am going to lose this settlement, I might as well destroy all the buildings. Since they're of no value to me anyway. The spy comes down here, I want to be keeping an eye on what's going on. These guys, I will try and get them out of here. They're not... Oh, hang on. Um... I probably prefer having the levy archers, so just I serve, keep Sultan. them, because they're cheaper upkeep. Yala. I mean, it doesn't matter about troop quality at this Jordan. stage, they're all going to die. I'll show you what I mean by um, just need numbers of units, not necessarily unit quality. I'll do that in a sec. Um, Your corpse will be thrown to the dogs. Now, destroy, 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 and destroy. guy here. His job Yala! is to provide as much resistance in regard to war of attrition as possible. So that's with forts. And that'll Why delay them. Even though they have it? artillery, we they do tend to, you know, place. siege for at least a year. Naam, so we'll create a fort there. Sultan. And a fort here. Inshallah. And this guy, he's we going to take... The fort in time. Uh, which general's better? This one. He's going to take that army back through the west. Because I want it out of here. There's no point defending this area. Just going to try and delay them as much as possible with the shit units that I've got available. So take them, put them on there. Take them as well, because they're decent. The watchtower so I can see what's going on. And let's get the fuck out of there. This guy here, put him back in Gorgon. Send this guy over there. Recruit them. Actually, could probably use some imams. Yeah, make it nice and high tax rate as well. Now, same thing over here. This guy what needs to be making forts. Minute? Start with one over here. You oh, fuck! Wrong here, thing. Sultan. Shit. Oh, it's not a big deal. Um, we march. As you will. But basically, that's going to speed it up by a turn, them getting here. Orders. And one more over here. Why is my Sultan? And then we this guy this here, and Sultan. we'll send him back to sit there. Essentially, I don't think they're going to come here within the next turn, because they're going to obviously take that shit settlement. Jack up the tax rates here. Doesn't matter if it riots. Going to lose it anyway. Orders. No point constructing anything here because 
this will probably be the next stage of things to, to be lost. I can delay them as much as possible, but I would say that eventually I will lose these two settlements here, and possibly this one as well. Now with this one, I'm going to take all the units out of here, but I'm going to recruit some as well. So that, that, and that will be recruited. And all of these guys will be moved to the west. Rest here until dawn. I also need to change the capital, I think, to Ray, because I'm going to lose that settlement. And this should actually improve my income, because this will be the center of my empire. Um, let me see. Yep, there we go. Increase my income, so that's good. And improve public order in this general area. Uh, what else do I need to do? Uh, where am I? I Move Imams faith. over to here, because that's where I really... Oh, actually, this guy... Send him out this way, he might be able to help, because I need to take out the west. He's not a great spy, but it's not too bad. Uh, this guy... You do that. How good are you? You're okay. I might send you... Over here, actually. And these guys... Upgrade the tax. Need some... Uh, this, this... And this... Yep. Okay, that's fine. So that we can get moving towards here. Need to start expanding as soon as possible. Even though it's got longer assimilations. Um, same here. Need to recruit. Actually, can I send the guys from Ray over there? No, they won't make it. That's fine. It's not really vital. Okay, so who do I want? I want... Quaresmian noblemen. Yep, even though they have expensive upkeep. They're fantastic units. And um, that's what I need to take out the Turks. Uh, Persian archers. What about heavy archers? Um, Saracen. Or is that... No, those are the heavy archers. Yep. Well, that's going to make me near broke soon. Because even though it says I'm going to make a profit, it's probably deceptive due to just how the game functions with this. Can I... How do I put on the scuttage? Go into something and I... I can't remember. How do I do the scuttage? gives me a little bit of extra money. It's that. I press that, but it's not enabling it right now. Maybe I have to have the general selected. Is that right? No. Maybe... I don't know. Maybe I can't do it this turn. What was I doing? Okay, so here I'm going to construct this, because that'll bring in money. I'm going to need m lots of money at this point. Uh, and this guy down here is going to move out this army, except for those two, because they're not really necessary. Oh, hang on. Yeah. Move these guys uh, out this way. First thing I'm going to do is step there. Continuing tomorrow, to build the watchtower because I need to be able to see what's going on in my land. And what am I going to build here? I'm going to build a masjid. Yep. Up the tax pretty much everywhere because it's going to come in handy. Uh, if I can avoid spending, maybe I should, but this will make returns in time. So, best invest now while I've got the money, because I'm probably going to go broke at some point. Up the tax where needed. I'm pretty sure one of these places around here has a really good mine. Is it this one? Yep, yeah, that's, that's not too bad. Don't bother recruiting. Because only, only the faction leader and the faction heir can actually invade other areas with this with this um, setting, without severe penalties. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. And then I need more merchants. Don't I have one? Yeah, here's one. I need to send him over here. Okay. Get some merchants from here. That'd be good. All right. So I'm looking at about eight thousand profit. 
Although, I'm, I can pretty much guarantee it's not going to be that much. Alright, let's just check some of my areas out. Let's have a look. Yep, we don't want to be building anything there. Okay, everything's doing something. That's the main thing. Orders. I'm kind of pissed off that I built that there. That's really going to speed up their expansion over me. Oh, well. Have to make do. Alright. Let's move on to the next turn. Oh, hang on, did I... Yeah, okay, moving on. So you can see straight away I lost about a thousand florins just to whatever. Paying off generals and shit like that. That's why it's important not to have too many with this um, particular um, sub-mod on. It is a siege. Sultan, the infidels dare to lay siege to our walls. Yep, bring on the overkill. The infidels wait at our gates, Sultan. It is a siege. Sultan, the infidels dare to lay siege to our walls. Just waiting for the turns to finish. Shouldn't be too much longer. It's only fucking turn one. Do not accept adoptions. What? Oh, right, right. Some of these have been besieged twice. Yeah. Yep. Kill those citizens, whatever. Doesn't matter. It's all theirs now. Okay, so I got another general. Uh, another family member, by the looks of it. So, uh... Is that... Is that a guy or a girl? I'm pretty sure that's a guy. Otherwise, I don't think it would have a last name. His last name's... Uh, for whatever. Hopefully, because girls are really aren't that valuable to me in this. What is the Sultan's will? Need soldiers. I mean, generals. Okay. Can't get him away, but that's okay. Um, next turn, they, they probably won't attack him. I just need to eventually get him out of there. Uh, this guy's here. I'll leave this one here. Because we just want one unit in each of these forts, because it'll delay them probably about one or two turns each. It doesn't matter about troop quality. Let's see. Where will I put another fort? Because each fort can delay them a little bit. Now, you might not think there's any point in um, building a fort there, but it might, they might target it. You know, it could delay them a bit. Inshallah! The AI in this is not particularly that smart. They don't really think that well. Build another one here. That's good. There. Put you there. Put you in there. And then... Where will I put you? Okay, they can go around both this way and that way from that point. So... We'll go there because this is the quickest way around. And just leave him there for the turn. Holy shit, all my money's fucking gone. So even though it said I was going to make an 8,000 profit, that was just bullshit. I should have maybe built a fort. I mean a watchtower, it doesn't matter. Keep going. Pick up all the soldiers you can that aren't necessary, that aren't have free upkeep. Okay, yes, time to get Lord moving Sultan. with this one. Sultan. Head over here against the, uh, against them. We move at first I don't know light. why it adjusted, but... Tomorrow's journey awaits. Whatever. Send Sultan. all of them How as well. Serve, Sultan. We move, nice Sultan. big army helps. Now that's not going to be good in regard to my income. 
I'm not going to bother putting anything in there. Any more units? Um, that's enough for recruitment. Keep that going. Might be able to get in there next turn. That'll be alright. Okay, you. you can keep going west. As you will, Sultan. Tomorrow awaits. Taking Baghdad would be great, but I'm just not ready to do that yet. Uh, you need to be over here. Remove Sultan. Watchtower, yep, and also put you them here. Join in the ranks. And I've got another one of you. Send him over here. So he's not the now best, rest, the best, but he's okay. And I want another merchant. These merchants will be worth it because of make me money, and that's what I need. I need lots of money. I need to be greedy in this because I'm gonna go broke. Great Sultan. Sultan. Just keep him going. The faith, as the Sultan will. And I think I need another merchant from here. Alright, what else do I need to do? There's no no need to construct anything. Actually that's End the hostilities. Uh, and we can talk again. Yeah. It'd be good if I could take his Establish money, but it's not gonna happen. My, master before we my ears are yours. Alright, let's put a spy in here. Maybe that'll delay them. Orders. Okay, what I'm gonna do is attack this guy. We shall end this day as and I should have done this last turn actually. I'm gonna get into. Oh, hang on a sec. If I do this, then that battle is lost. Actually, that could be okay. Alright, we're going to attack, but I'm going to withdraw straight away. And what that'll do is it'll send me flying down over this way. Actually, that could be very bad. Don't do that. Because then I won't be able to retreat again next turn. So I'll just, I'll just leave that as it is. I need to be very careful. I don't want that guy to die. I should have done it last turn if I was going to do that. Okay. Alright, let's move on to the next turn. Yep, here they make their attack. Just order resolve it, there's no point fighting it. Same with here. Oh, they don't attack me anyway. The um, the Shah that is. Now, there's, losing those two settlements is inevitable, but that has now reduced my income. Which is why it's insanely important that I bloody get moving in regard to expansion. Just gotta expand right on top of the Turks. Because I wouldn't be surprised if I was in the red next turn. That's how fucking painful this damn advanced supply script is. Basically, it just ensure, ensures that you're broke all the time. I'm not broke, that's interesting. Uh, no, don't need you. New mission. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. Do I have any diplomats? I've got this guy up here. Oh, okay, maybe I will send him to the, uh, the Cumans, which are up this way. No. -uh. Might be worth an extra 500. Actually, let's just see if I can get peace with no these guys. You are lucky we will receive you at all, infidel. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. Keep that up, and you will... This bodes poorly for... Oh, I, I should have done that. He lost his, um... Lost his trait. Yes, my master. Doesn't matter. Yes, Sultan. Resting here, mighty Sultan. With the money that I've got left, I think I should purchase merchants. Sultan. All right. Now, send them down you this way. Continuing Even from there, I'm pretty sure they can Sultan. reach me because their generals have a lot of um, 
they've got good traits so they can actually reach me. If they do, we fight the battle and run away straight away and that should send me right back to a fort. That's what I'm thinking what should happen. Alright. Need this guy to keep coming west. And that's the watchtower. You over here as well. We march. Continue as my sultan will. Now, my eyes are yours. Can we? Oh, oh, chance of success 21%. That means they've got a spy in there. Unseen, invisible. Oh, well, at least I can keep an eye on what's going on over here. I'm not going to be able to take it this turn. I'm honored to serve. Sultan. What's the point if I can't get as in there? I'm going to risk it. Yes, so I'm just going to sit. Let's see. How far does this have to go? Can go. How may I serve, Sultan? Put him there. Noble one. Put him there. Joining All our right. armies together. We shall cool. take our rest here, Sultan. And then that's pretty much all I can do, except I for let's will. see, where can I put this merchant? Seventy-four. Or what else is over this way? Gold. Alright, that's where I want you to go. It's a bit of a distance, but yes. once you get there, I think it'll be well worth the trip. Hopefully there's nobody Very sitting good. here Today's when I get there. Because that'd fucking suck. Orders. I need another merchant. Ah, uh, no, I think I've got enough. Get you meat. here, the extra Wherever 230. You will, and you. Yes. No, you're not very good, but still, you'll make Sultan, a bit of money. Tomorrow awaits. Maybe I'll just purchase one more merchant from here. One more merchant there, and then with this guy, with the Sultan. last bit of his money. We move, Sultan. Build a watchtower. Rest here until dawn. And then pick up these. You units. shall see all from here, Sultan. We march. Merging our army. It's not a big concern because the population is going down. Okay then. These guys Sultan? send them out this way. Yes. Cause as much problems as, as possible. This ammo here. Oh, this is my region. I need to be putting them in their region. To stop Today's paganism from getting strong. Ends, great Sultan. And you no, save, Sultan. make a bit of money by sitting in the town. Yeah, a little bit. That's good. Sultan. And send him over there. And now we wait, I suppose, in that regard. Let's just see how we go. See how far I'm I can get with this start. army. We need to get as far as possible. I'm gonna be broke next turn. That's pretty much for sure. But I can take Tabriz next turn as well. All right, let's move on to the next turn. A terrible sight. The enemy All right. surrounds our walls, Sultan. So they've attacked one of my forts. They'll probably assault next turn. No point fighting that battle. Uh, this one, withdrawing, probably send him over here and then they'll just attack me again. But if I fight and then withdraw, I might be lucky enough to be sent back to here. Inshallah, most of us will see the sun set again. But the end. Okay, so all we want to do is get the fuck away. And off we go. Because again, this army is to be sent to the west to just, you know, Basically what I have to do is try and conquer my enemies, or my other enemies, faster than the Mongols can conquer me, which I think is possible. Because if I lay forts around at every choke point, all that kind of shit, they'll delay as, as much as possible. Yep, so got sent back here. He's safe now. He'll be able to just siphon right through all those forts, and he'll be able to get back to um, 
as far west as possible. So the Shah was the going to live. So journey. historically, this didn't happen. The, the Shah was killed, I think, there by the uh, by the Mongols. So already history has changed. For the better, I think. I always fucking hated the Mongol invasion or Mongols. I just found them to be fucking pointless. Their huge empire that lasted like one generation. What was the point of that? Even though they sort of hung around a little while longer, the actual Genghis Khan's empire did not last very long. Yep. I'll accept that. And I am fucking broke beyond belief. That is not good, but it's to be expected. I mean, I could have disbanded 5,000 uh, florins worth of units, but then how am I supposed to expand? As Better I invest it into warfare. So, what I'll do now is take Tabriz. No reason why I shouldn't. Uh, let's see, get this guy out of here. So, we're going to put you, uh, where are you going to go? Over this way. We march. And take Rest the best of these guys with you. Because this guy can actually go and attack Riding another Gerais. region. And he'll meet up with this guy, Sultan. and we're going to attack something out this way. So, I'll have two invasions at a time. This guy up what here, he's going to reinforce, uh, the, Sh the Shahzad. Orders. You, uh, up this way. Off we go. We move, uh, I'd love to make a the watchtower here, but I got no money. Journey. Anyway, let's Double take our first region. Uh, currently, I'm two regions smaller than what I started off. Taking this will make me just one region smaller this than I was. Now, I want to win this battle without taking a single fucking casualty. That's what I want to do, that's my goal. So let's see if we can do it. We shall not fall or flee! We attack! For the moment, the fickle smile of fortune shines upon us. Pray this is a portent of a victory! Whatever. Alright, so we're gonna knock down the wall. I mean... Yep, that'll be fine. I mean, I really should try and actually knock down the gate instead. So, I've got a lot of ammo, and they should be able to do it. They're not very accurate at taking down the gates. But we'll give it a shot. If things start looking a bit crap, then... I'll change my mind. And it, it will be up to these guys to kill those Saracens. Let's just go a little bit... Oh, fuck. They're gonna shoot at my guys. Started off a bit too close. Did I get any casualties? No, good. No, 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 no. Do not shoot just yet. Because they're running back to the town square. Alright, let's see how we go. Good, already started doing some damage. Alright, speed it up. Expecting results. Because if I destroy the gate, then the actual building at the campaign level isn't going to be damaged. But if I destroy the wall, then it is. And I can't afford to repair the wall. And if the Turks came back, I would like it if the wall to be, you know, still standing. I need to save as much money as possible. Okay, good. That was quick. Kind of expected it to take a little bit longer. Oh, whoops. Okay, so which of these archers are best? So we've got Saracen archers, missile attack four, five, and five. Focus on using these guys. I think they're better than the Saracen archers. Slightly. Not by a lot. And that's one of the things I really like about Islamic armies in this era. Era. Very good archers and, and cavalry. And, you know, 
I prefer in the Middle Ages that the to use a, an Islamic faction because I think that they're far more advanced than the Christian factions. It wasn't until I think the uh, 17th and 18th century uh, did the Christian uh, Christian uh, countries in the West um, catch up to the Muslim ones and then overtake them. I mean, the Ottoman Empire was still a pain in the uh, the Christians' asses for a very long time after that as well, up until the 20th century. So jittery, is it because of my recording software? It shouldn't be. I've recorded off this before. I wonder if it's, it's, it's my settings. I haven't got them set that high. This is very jittery. fairly close. They're bound to be a little bit tired. Well, very tired, but that's okay. If they leave the town square, I will send my general to go and kill them off they come after me. Yeah. Alright, let's go. I don't want any casualties to be taken on my side. Stop for a second. They'll probably come back to the town square as soon as I see that I'm not going to fight them. Yep, predictable. Keep shooting. Get out of there, you fuckheads. Can you stop shooting, please? I don't want to take any casualties. Doesn't help that you're exhausted. It's okay if this guy takes casualties as long as, as, long as these guys don't. Uh, Our men have fuck. taken control of the city. Are they going back? Yep, they're going back. Good. And shoot them from there. That'd be good because they're. Curses! Our men no longer command the city. Good, got a whole bunch of their kills there. Only half the enemy force remains. We must pray Just they lose keep their on will skirmishing. to fight. I don't want to take a single casualty on this. Get out of there, if you would. Stop shooting you. Send the general back here. Yep. Just play back and forth. There's nothing they can do, really. Shoot them again. Okay, now they've given up even bothering. They can see that there's no point in chasing me down, so they're just going to sit there and die. Which is what I want them to do. Praise be to Allah! The enemy's general lies dead! Now his men can sense their doom upon them. 
they can take a lot of shots. Jeez, I ran out of ammo with one guy left. Oh well. Let's see how he likes a bit of a, Our men have taken a bit of a punching. Ours. A victory both righteous and well deserved. It cannot be said otherwise. Good. Now we always have to uh, occupy these uh, settlements, especially Muslim ones, because sacking them doesn't really give a lot of money, destroys a lot of buildings, and makes my generals dreadful. And you don't want them to have a lot of dread in this. I don't think it does much. That's just how they've designed this particular game. I mean, the mod. Anyway, I think I might end the video there. So... That's good, I've expanded there. That's worth 1,284 a turn to me. I can't make any decisions on it this turn, though. Um, not that I could anyway, out of money. Um, oh, shit. I will not waste words on I serve your will. It's not much, but... I don't know what they're thinking there. Um, I just need to keep expanding on the Turks. Take as many of these regions around here as possible. Uh, eventually get to Jerusalem. Uh... Basically, I also want to put down another condition. If the Mongols take Jerusalem, I fail this challenge, even if I'm still alive. So, that's my goal. I have to defeat them, and they must never, ever get to Jerusalem. Okay, so I'm going to end the video here. So, like and subscribe. Part 2 is next. And don't forget to visit me on Facebook. I'll see you next time.